Recently, I watched the movie Bohemian Rhapsody, as I am a huge fan of Queen. If anyone hasn't seen the movie, I highly recommend it. But if you know anything about the band Queen, you know that the lead singer, Freddie Mercury, was gay and eventually contracted HIV and unfortunately died of AIDS. At the end of the movie, it mentioned that Freddie died of pneumonia brought on by AIDS. While sitting in the theater, this made me think of the topic of this video. Do people actually die from AIDS? HIV, or the human immunodeficiency virus, harms the person's immune system. It eventually becomes AIDS if the disease progresses. I actually made a video more in depth right here. When somebody has AIDS, their immune system is almost nothing. This results in the person being highly susceptible to diseases and illnesses. The person then gets a disease or a type of cancer that only occurs because of their shot immune system, and either of these two things becomes fatal. According to the World Health Organization, the most common infection related death as a result of AIDS is tuberculosis. But the cause of death is almost an odds game once you get AIDS. Eventually you will get some disease or infection, and it depends on external factors and chance really. Going back to Freddie Mercury, his AIDS made him susceptible to illnesses, he happened to contract pneumonia, and unfortunately wasn't able to fight it off. Thanks so much for watching. We hope that you learned something new and enjoyed it. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Check out our other videos above. Thank you so much for your support. Have yourself a great day.